The reason that uh, the block, and in fact the company is called Lignocite, is that we, we've taken the Latin for wood, lignum, uh, that went into the name Lignocite, which was the main product, and is also now the name of the company. The magic ingredient in those blocks was the wood itself, and wood makes blocks light, warm, smooth, and very good in a farm. So what we have here at Brandon is a, is a brand new state-of-the-art plant which we invested in very heavily about five years ago. We make about 100,000 blocks a day and that equates to something like 100 houses uh, worth of material. The other thing, of course, that is particularly pertinent at the moment is carbon capture. And wood captures a great deal of carbon dioxide. Because of the, the process of photosynthesis, uh, wood captures something like four times as much CO2 as either uh, straw or hemp. Our most recent block that we have created is something called Carbon Buster. And this is a combination of a lignocyte block incorporating the wood shavings and also an aggregate which is being made here at Brandon by a joint venture company called Carbonate. The combination of the wood and the carbonate aggregate locks up more CO2 than is released in uh, all of the manufacture and in fact transport of that block up to 100 miles from this plant. We believe that that's the first carbon negative, genuinely carbon negative block uh, in the country and possibly in the world. The other thing that really interests us is working with designers. We um, have come up with quite a few new innovations of blocks in different sizes, shapes, forms. Glass is, is one of the things that uh, we have certainly majored on in the last four or five years and that was used on the Olympic Village and was also used in a project uh, in Blackpool where they wanted bling and we used luminescent powder coated glass which warms up during the day from the sun's rays uh, and then emits a gentle light for about eight hours. But we also put for example shells, waste shells from uh, Kings Lynn from the shellfish industry into our blocks and then we process them, we either uh, shot blast them or split them or polish or planish them. So we, in the polishing process we put them through a, a 10 head Italian terrazzo polisher and, uh, and the effects really are very beautiful. And we love working with designers, contractors who've, who've got a concept which, which we can then adapt, work on and, and hopefully meet their needs.